And so I, I don't really have a lot more to say on this slide because this is the end and it's the the last point on the last slide. But just to kind of wrap up, what is going on here? Here it is. But just to sort of wrap up this particular lecture in a way that doesn't feel so abrupt, I'll just maybe link it to where we're heading. Um, today's or this this lecture between, between today and, and on Monday was about the creation of the Constitution and all the compromises and, and the different discussion points that had to have been made. And so where we are leaving it today, the Constitution is largely created. They've created these four rinky-dink little protections of individual freedoms. They've solved some issues like congressional representation and others they didn't really solve like voting rights or, you know, what to do about slavery, um, but they got as, as much as they could get done and maintain the union of the 13 state colonies, the, the original colonies and states. And so now they send off the constitution to the individual states for them to ratify, for them to vote on, right? And as I said, right, the lack of the addressment of individual rights issues becomes a major issue because certain states are saying, well, we're not signing that unless there's more guarantees of individual freedoms. And so the question that I want you to answer, the only question on today's lecture, is um, what did the founding fathers then do next, right? Like why, when, what, if they if they spent months building this thing, they're really proud of it, they've solved a lot of issues, they've created a real like piece of governing genius, and it gets to the states and some of them refuse to sign. What do they do? What do they add to it? What do they change? What's their next move? You can use history if you know the answer to this. If you do not, it might be a good time to explore. Um, it'd be a good time to read your textbook and begin working on your study guide. Um, but that is it for today's lecture, just a, a smooth 17 minutes and one question. Um, use this extra time to work on your study guide. Maybe get ahead on next week's, um, you know, what, what checkpoint on the election project. Um, and maybe I'll see some of you today um, at, uh, what's, let's say, uh, 1245 to 115 for office hours. And then um, for the college counseling session. Let's see here. College counseling session is um, 11.45 to, to 12.30. Have a good afternoon, everyone. I'll see you later.